Hey, what's going on? This is Rob from Panther. Today we're going to check it out this fluid special effect in Spline. Step one, delete the rectangle, click on the background color, change it to something light. Let's select the sphere from here, click on it, press Ctrl Shift plus Alt, create a sphere. Let's change the color. I'm going to go with something more pink. Go to the light, change the lights to screen. Click on the plus to add the material. Let's add the displace. Let's increase the displacement from eight to, I'm gonna go with some around 70. Click on the displacement. I'm gonna change the simplex to Ashima. I'm gonna increase the scale until it's gonna be like pretty spiky. I'm gonna go some around 30. And as you can see, it's really edgy, but we want it smooth. So we're gonna click on smooth and edit. And we're gonna increase the level all the way up to five. It looks good. I'm gonna click on X here, up. And from here, we're gonna add another material and we're gonna change it to depth. Click on the depth. I'm gonna recolor the white as some cyan. I'm gonna click on the black. I'm gonna decrease the opacity to zero. And here, as you can see, we've got these handles. If I bring the handle with the cyan, it's gonna start popping out the cyan color. And I'm gonna bring the black a little bit more out and also the cyan maybe. So it's gonna look something like this. From here, we're gonna add another material and we're gonna select the matte cap. I'm gonna change this to screen. I'm gonna click on the matte cap so I can change it. I'm gonna go with this one. From here, we're gonna animate it. I'm gonna click on it, click on the state on the plus, and I'm gonna click on the displacement. I'm gonna increase the movement to 150, click on enter. I'm gonna click on the event plus. I'm gonna click on the transition, transition again, change the transition from easing out to linear, and we're gonna add duration somewhere around 30. Click on play and voila, there you go. And this is how you make this gelatin special effect in Spline. Thanks for watching and if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates and also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a good one, bye bye.